Yo, 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 what's going on? It's your boy Jay Mitch. I'm out here with the Limitless. Again, hopefully this will be a good pass. I uh, just had to make one or two little adjustments to the car. I think this is gonna be the day uh, that we get the number we wanted to get. Uh, anyway, show y'all zeroing out the zeroing out the GPS. Show you start, show y'all. She picking up, gonna stop it. It's a little windy out today, but we still gonna go with it. But I stopped it, start the GPS, nothing coming. I'm gonna make her track straight and then now she's pulling. She's pulling to the left. Straighten her out, get her straight. She's pulling to the right now, pull it back. She's pulling to the right. Going to the right again. Let's get her going to the left. Ways nothing coming. It's a good pass. It's a good pass, guys. Get on the other side of the street, car coming. Give it a second. This car will get past. I'll bring it up. She's moving around just a little bit, going down. We'll bring her back. Eight ass pass. Let's see what we got. I don't know if we got that 150, but if we did, it was pretty damn close. Let me stop the GPS, read. 139 139 uh, that's interesting i don't know why we would have lost a mile per hour um but i don't know i'm tempted to do another pass i think because i had to drive i had to drive it so much uh so let me see see if i can get the car dialed in i'm, I'm talking to y'all but I, i'm gonna do another pass fuck it let's do another pass real quick so, stop, start the GPS. She was pulling to the left. I had, to, she was like pulling to the left a little bit the whole time. So I'm gonna dial it back just a little bit to just compensate. She's still pulling to the left. Uh, Turn it around. Look both ways, nothing coming. Uh oh. Wheel came off. Saw that from here. Now the question is, do I want to walk down there? I think I'm gonna drive down there because I'm a lazy fuck today. Give me a second. Oh 
always check your wheel nuts, guys. Car didn't crash though, wheel just came off. Let me go down there and get it. Won't be able to find that wheel, but that's all right. Damn, I lost the wheel nut too. Lost the wheel nut and the wheel. I'm gonna leave the car there and see if I can find the wheel. Oh, there it is. Damn, the fucking wheel blew. The wheel blew up, guys. Ripped up pretty good. Wow. But could have been worse. Could have been a lot worse than it was. Let's see what kind of mile power. Oh wow, that might have been the reason why I didn't get the speed I wanted to. Let's see, it's, it's uh shredded. But let me go ahead and take a look. Get a look at it. Stop the GPS. Read 140, 41, 141 mile per hour on that. So I'm gonna go ahead and uh, let me get the car back up to the spot and um, get the car back up to the spot and I'll let you guys get a look up under the hood. The first run was official though at 139. Stayed in it a little longer, pushed it. We got that 141 which I'm not mad at guys not mad at that at all stick with me take the car out let you guys see what's under the hood GPS you can see the GPS right through the body that's crazy oh wow, both of my rear is blue oh shit holy shit Here's my battery. Special major shout out to Max Amps. I bought two of these 8S's so I can run 16S in something one day. But these are 5,000 milliamp hours, uh, 175C graphene light bulbs for Max Amps. Um, dope batteries, as you can see, we put down some good numbers. Uh, I am running an XLX2 uh, TP Power 2200 KV motor. It's warm, but it's not hot. Probably, if I had to guesstimate, maybe about 130 degrees. Um, I am running Perfect Pass. Um, I do have a gyro in here. Um, and I'm running Scorched RC everything. Everything in this car is Scorched. Um, chassis, front, uh, front drive shaft, front locker. Um, and um, I mean, just Scorched RC everywhere. Um, I got this front splitter from DRG um, RC. Check them out. Check out their website, DRG RC. Sorry. Um, no cat pack. I am running the Scorched RC uh, center spool and I am running the titanium drive shafts from um, Scorched RC. Um, I did pick up some um, to get rid of that, uh, that chassis rubbing on the ground. I did buy the uh, the uh, 
uh, these springs off of eBay um, that keep the car up or they, they have a they have a um, less uh, coil to them so they're really stiff a lot stiffer springs on the car and that's definitely helping out with keeping this off off the ground but you guys saw how the car was moving of course we got to replace the grps i got a, plenty of new sets of grps to throw on the car but these have held up well i've had these same grps from the last time from the you know from when i did the 149 pass and the 147 pass on the car but you guys see we're really close and it, actually you can see probably here why the the uh why the um grp got lost probably came into contact with this body um because i did have magnetic strips here to hold the body from moving but i this probably was flailing in the wind and that's what caught the grp and, and scraped the grp yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and end it if you haven't yet please remember to like comment and subscribe to the channel um shout out to my homie dave hubbard rest in peace the homie ted adam from rc discount hector and mark from rc discount and everybody supports your boy's channel. Special shout out to my homeboy, um, RC Addicts, man. Get yourself back up on the road. I'll see you in a few with that uh, 5B. Going to kill the game. Um, shout out to Phil Jolly. He helped me out with the suspension setup a little bit. Um, and just everybody's good advice on getting this car set up. Thank you all for watching. Y'all be good now.